Ever wondered what foods can outlast almost anything and still be safe to eat? So, you're gearing up for long-term food storage and you want to make sure your stash will stand the test of time, right? I've been down that road a time or two, and let me tell you, there are some foods that are absolute gold mines when it comes to shelf life. These items are like the unicorns of the prepper world because they just won't go bad. Well, saddle up, because here's a list of 10 foods for your prepper pantry that never expire. These bad boys have your back no matter what, and they'll still be good to go, even when the world is a little less predictable. Without further ado, here are the 10 foods to stockpile in your prepper pantry that will never expire. Number 10. Salt. Now, salt isn't just some seasoning you sprinkle on your fries. Nope. This gem has been a vital player in human history. Way before refrigeration, folks like us have been using salt to cure and preserve meat. It was essential, especially when you're trying to make that winter stockpile last till spring. Whether it's the kind that comes from the sea, the stuff from your local diner's shaker, or that fancy pink Himalayan stuff that gets everyone talking, they've all got this amazing longevity. Just a heads up, you've got to keep it dry. Moisture and salt, not the best combo. So stash it somewhere without humidity, and that salt will stand by you through thick and thin. Trust me on this. Number nine, white rice. So I've been on this quest, right? trying to make my storage game a tad greener, and lo and behold, I found myself staring at this old seltzer bottle the other day. A light bulb moment struck, and I thought, this could be perfect for storing rice. After a good scrub and making darn sure it was as dry as the Sahara, I funneled that rice right in. And here's a pro tip from one prepper to another. That bottle? Gotta be dry as a bone. The last thing you want is moisture cozying up to your rice. Now, speaking of rice, ever hear those tales of the dreaded rice weevils? Yeah, those tiny buggers that sometimes make rice their home. Well, knock on wood, but I've yet to cross paths with them. Maybe it's my ninja-like speed in transferring rice, or that I ensure my cap is on super tight. But let's say you open your bottle and find a couple of those little critters waltzing around. Keep your cool. In some places around the globe, they don't even bat an eyelid. Some folks pick them out, while others, they just cook the rice, weevils and all. Little secret, those weevils, packed with protein. So whether you decide to evict them or just let them be, remember to store your rice the right way. It's all about the journey, not the occasional weevil. Number eight, vinegar. Now there's a real old timer. See, vinegar's got this spunky attitude thanks to its acidic nature. Doesn't matter if you're into apple cider, the clear white stuff, or if you've got a thing for the richer balsamic, vinegar's got your back. And guess what? It ain't just for drizzling on your greens or adding that tang to your dishes. Next time you've got a stubborn stain or you're hunting for a natural cleaner, grab that bottle of vinegar. The best part? Its lasting power means you've always got this handy-dandy tool waiting in the wings. Time doesn't phase vinegar one bit. Number seven, honey. I mean, come on. If there was ever a golden gift from nature, honey would be it. This isn't just some sweet syrup. It's history in a jar. Civilizations have been enamored with it, written poems about it, and have even fought wars over bee gold. Now, ever wonder why honey's got this legendary status? It's a fortress against bacteria and other microscopic party crashers. With its low water game and high acidity, it's like Mother Nature went, nope, no spoiling on my watch. Ever heard about those archaeologists finding pots of honey in ancient Egyptian digs? Yeah, that honey. Good as new after thousands of years. And hey, if your honey starts looking a bit grainy or crystallized, no stress. It hasn't gone rogue. A gentle warm-up, and it's back to being that smooth, pourable treasure. So next time you glance at that honey jar on your shelf, give it a nod of respect. It's not just there to sweeten your tea, but stands as proof of nature's unbeatable preservative skills. Now that's what I call food security. Number six, canned meat. When I say it, I bet the neon glow of a spam label is flashing in your mind, isn't it? But hold on a second, because there's a vast canned meat universe out there just waiting to be explored. Dive a bit deeper, and you'll stumble upon treasures like the trusty tuna, the savory salmon, the robust beef, and, yes, even the versatile chicken. Talk about a smorgasbord. Now, why am I so stoked about these metallic containers of meaty goodness? Protein, my friend. It's like the gasoline for our bodies. If you ever find yourself in a pinch, be it during an unforeseen situation or on a spontaneous mountain hike, these protein-packed champions will fuel you up in no time. They stand tall and proud, like the guardians of your pantry, always ready to swoop in when hunger strikes. Now, if you're nodding and thinking, 
I need to get me some of that. Here's a nugget of wisdom. Your can's health is paramount. Keep an eye out for dings, rust, or anything that seems off. That seal on the can? That's your fortress against the outside world. Keep it intact and the delicious payload inside stays pristine. Whether you're gearing up for a wilderness adventure or need a quick protein punch, these trusty cans won't let you down. Number five, instant coffee. A true lifesaver for many caffeine aficionados out there. You know, for those who deeply understand the allure of caffeine, instant coffee is nothing short of a wonder potion. Safely nestled in its jar, it seems almost innocent. But when you carefully ensure that its nemesis, the dreaded moisture, doesn't get to it, and it's tucked away in that perfect spot where it's cool and dry, it becomes a beacon of hope. A beacon that promises alertness and banishes drowsiness. And the age of the jar? Oh, it's just a number. Whether it's been a week or it's gathering a thin layer of dust from sitting for ages, once you twist that lid open, the magic begins. That burst of rich aroma is not just a scent. It's an experience. It's like a friendly nudge whispering, Hey, good times are just a sip away. So no matter if the sun is gleefully darting behind the clouds, or if the morning has that familiar gloom, that tiny jar holds the power to infuse warmth and positivity into the day. All you need is a cup and a moment. So here's to every jar and every moment it's been a part of. Bottoms up. Number four, white sugar. White sugar, the silent hero of many kitchens. It's kind of like that reliable old friend who's always there when you're in a pinch. One might think, it's just sugar. But, oh boy, when stored right, this sweet sentinel stands the test of time like a champ. Now, I've meandered around stores and spotted those hulking 10-pound cans of sugar. And let me tell you, they are a sight to behold. And while the idea of having a mini mountain of sugar may give some folks the prepper giggles, you don't necessarily need to go down that route. Instead, let's keep things straightforward, shall we? Peek around your kitchen and you might find an airtight container, or 10, gathering dust. That right there? Your ticket to sugar longevity. Pour in your sugar, snap that lid on tight, and find it a cozy, dry spot. With that, you're golden. It's simple, yet it ensures your sugar is ready to sweeten the deal whenever you need. Whether you're stirring up a storm in the kitchen or just need a sprinkle for your morning oats, rest easy knowing that sugar's timeless reliability has got your back. Number three, soy sauce. You know, soy sauce has been a staple in many cultures for centuries. Its rich, salty flavor adds depth to a myriad of dishes. But did you know that when stored properly, an unopened bottle of this magical elixir can practically last forever? Yep, that's right. The secret lies in its high salt content. All that salt doesn't just give it its characteristic taste, but also acts as a natural preservative. This makes the environment inside the bottle quite unwelcoming for bacteria. They just can't thrive in there. However, once you break that seal and let the air in, things change a bit. Although it won't necessarily spoil in the way some foods do, if you're someone who appreciates the nuances in flavor, you'd want to refrigerate it post-opening. The cold helps in preserving its rich flavor profile, ensuring that your dishes get that authentic soy sauce kick every single time. Over the years, even if stored under perfect conditions, you might notice a subtle shift in its taste, Flavors, after all, are dynamic, but even with those changes, it's incredibly rare for soy sauce to go bad in the way we typically understand it, like turning moldy or causing food poisoning. Number two, hardtack. Think of this as the granddaddy of all survival biscuits. It's straightforward, comprising just water, salt, and flour. Sounds simple, right? But there's genius in its simplicity. The result is an extremely hard biscuit. You might even say it's teeth-defyingly hard. But here's the thing. Its toughness was its virtue. Sailors and soldiers, who were often away for extended periods, relied on this. The idea wasn't to tantalize the taste buds. Oh, no. The goal was longevity and dependability. And as long as it's kept dry, this biscuit refuses to spoil, making it the ideal companion for those long voyages or treks. Not the tastiest, mind you, but sometimes functionality wins over flavor. Number one, pemmican. It's a testament to human ingenuity when it comes to food preservation. Originating from the ingenious methods of the indigenous peoples of North America, this was not just food, it was a lifeline. Imagine a blend of dried meat, often from robust animals like bison, elk, or deer, mixed with fat and occasionally berries. This wasn't just about preservation, but also nutrition. 
a compact, high-energy food source that asked for nothing in return. No refrigeration, no special storage conditions. Just keep it packed tight, and this blend could literally outlast decades. It was the go-to for explorers, fur traders, and native tribes, especially when they had to cover long distances or when fresh food played hard to get. And there you have it! Ten timeless treasures to stock up in your prepper pantry. Whether you're planning for the unexpected, a grand adventure, or just ensuring you have some ageless edibles on hand, these items have proven themselves time and time again. Now, before we wrap things up, I've got a little request for you. If you found this information useful and you haven't done so yet, hit that subscribe button. It means the world to us and ensures you won't miss out on more epic content like this. Also, smash that like button if this list got your prepper senses tingling. And here's where I need a favor. In the comments section below, share with us what foods you already have in your prepper pantry and which ones from our list you need to stock up on. We're a community here, and learning from each other is what makes us stronger. Thank you for sticking around, and remember, preparation today ensures peace of mind tomorrow. Stay safe and see you in the next video.